Welcome to the virtual office training. Today we will learn how to create a balance sheet through pivot table in Microsoft Excel. In our first video we created this journal journal. In our second video we generated the trial balance through pivot table. In our third video we generated the profit and loss account through pivot table. In this video we generate the report of balance sheet through pivot table. Let's start. First go to the insert and click pivot table and I want a new worksheet click OK. Now pivot table option are available here. Now if you move to the general journal here is a accounts group. There are all the balance sheet category current assets, fixed assets, current liability, long term liability and owner equity and in here I just drag the accounts group into the rows it will display all the category of balance sheet now i want a all the chart of accounts just drag the accounts into the rows it will display all the chart of accounts in this pivot table now i want a balance column just drag into the sum values it will display the value of each item now I want a blank line on each item just click here and move to the design here is the option blank rows just click insert blank line after each item it will insert a blank line to each category now I want a this data in tabular form just go to the report layout here is the option show in tabular form and I don't want a grand total here just move to the grand total and off for rows and column now the grand total will disappear now here is a current assets total current liability total and fixed asset total and owner equities total here is another column blank this is a profit and loss account item in if you see here in general journal this is a blank cell this is a profit and loss account now it will display all the item of profit and loss account in blank here if I click here it will display the 10,000 net profit and I will give the name retain earning here now drag the fixed asset here and this is a current liability owner equity and retain earning and I want a two calculated field I want to calculate total current assets and total fixed assets just go to the analyze here is the option calculation just click here and click calculated item and now type here total assets in formula just double click current assets plus fix assets and click add and click ok it will generate the total assets just click here in minus sign now the total assets are 2,25,000 just move to the above this is a total assets I just highlight these total assets now I need a one another calculate field total liability plus total owner equity plus retain earning just go to the analyze and calculation and here is the option calculated item just type here total liabilities plus total owner equity in formula just double click here current liability plus owner equity plus retain earnings 
if you have a long term liability you can also add long term liability here if you have now click add and click ok it will display total liability plus total owner equity just double click here and these are 2 lakh 25,000 just highlight this now total assets is equal to total liability plus total owner equity these are balance that's where you can create a balance sheet through pivot table if you don't want this layout just go to the design and here is option report layout and show in compact form if I change the general journal to see this report is working or not just go to the general journal and increase the salaries expense here this is a 5000 I just type here 10,000 now what is the impact in balance sheet just click here there is no impact here but if I right click the mouse and click refresh it will show the impact now total assets are 2 lakh 20 thousand because return earning are decreasing because we increase the expense that's where you can create a balance sheet through pivot table in Microsoft Excel. Hope this tip will be very helpful for you. Thanks for watching.